welcome all my beautiful YouTube family and today what we're going to do guys is we're going to do something with a little bit of a twist again uh, Italian style because I've got a lot of Italian friends out there so what I'm going to do guys is we're going to do some prawns with some um, truffle oil from Italy uh, with some curly fettuccine that we had left the other day I'm going to cook that in a little bit of garlic and some butter all right I made it up okay and that's what we do all right now what I'm going to do guys, I've put my stove on alright, so I'm going to let that uh, heat up. In the meantime, what I'm going to do is I'm going to chuck a piece of butter that I had left in the fridge. In the wok. We're cooking in a wok, okay, so it's a, a little bit of a twist, don't forget. Alright guys, uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to let that butter melt. While that butter melts, I'm going to add a little bit of garlic. So what I do is got to get a little bit of a spoon. I'm going to put some crushed garlic through it. We've got our curly fettuccine that we got left over from the other day. And we're going to use that. We've got some parsley that I chopped up. We're going to toss it through. We've got some garlic paste from Origin. All right. Sorry about the focusing. The camera keeps focusing for some reason at night time. And we're going to use the famous Bosco d'Oro uh, black truffle oil from Italy, oh, this was nearly $30 a bottle, so it's about $120 a, a, a litre, guys. So it's very expensive. Uh, apparently, black truffle oil is the best, and this is a product of Italy, as you can see on the front. So I'm going to infuse that with um, the pasta and the prawns. So before I continue, guys, I'm just going to let the prawns melt. Sorry, not the prawns melt, the butter melt. I don't know where that came from. I want to add some garlic paste. Or flavor. I don't want to add too too much, just a spoon, because we don't want that that um to overtake the uh, the truffle oil flavor. Right, so I'll mix that through a little bit. Check that spoon in there. I'm gonna get my beautiful black mixer. All right, before I chuck these corns in, I'm just gonna pull that aside, guys. The only reason why I'm doing this, all right, is I've got my prawns. All right, so what I'm going to do is I had Absolute Australia uh, vlogs I comment last time and said, what that? How do you butterfly the prawns? Can you show me? So what I'm going to do is, look, I've already, already butterflied these ones. All right, so they're called butterfly. So I butterfly them, they're all ready to go. So what happens when you cook them? They have a nice, beautiful effect. So what I've got, guys, is I've got about four of them on my left there to show. Now, when you do it this way, make sure you don't do it this way because you will cut your hand. I'm a professional walk, so that's the only reason why I'm doing it this way. So you grab a prawn this way, all right? You slice it through this way. And then that's it, all right? So I've got four to show you guys. Oh, I'm joking. I was only kidding. There we go. Another one. All right, third one. Make sure you use a chopping board, use a proper knife, and don't cut your hands, okay? So the third one. We're going to do one more just to show you guys. All right, so right through the middle. Make sure they're all de-vein tail removed, and then you butterfly them like that. There you go. Absolute Australia. Alright, so I'm just going to wash my hands guys, it won't be long because I want to get rid of that prawn uh, smell from my hand. I hope everyone's well and this video isn't going to take too long. And in the meantime guys, uh, I'm going to do a shout out soon for everyone. Uh, just be patient with me, I'm not mentioning these guys because um, they've asked a few questions. Alright, so now we've got our prawns guys, we're going to add our prawns in the garlic and butter. We'll let that cook. And uh, while I'm mentioning prawns, and seafood and all this stuff, guys, you need to go onto Maple uh, Cook. All right, uh, absolutely amazing brother of mine from Canada. He does these most amazing videos, right? He does them like once a month. But the last video he did, guys, was, um, it's a thousand dollar dish, I'm telling you. And he competes with, uh, what's that guy's name? Gordon Ramsay. All right, so he gives him a bit. And um, I reckon he did better than Gordon Ramsay. So Maple Cook, mate. You're number one, I'm telling you. All right, so make sure you subscribe, follow, like and share, and absolute Australia vlogs as well. All right, Michelle. 
I'm going to show you what it looks like in a sec before I add the rest of the ingredients. So I'm just going to toss the uh, prawns in the garlic, guys. And I want to show you guys what the butterfly and the prawns look like. It gives it... What it does is it absorbs a little bit more flavour between the prawn as well. And also gives it a nice effect and a nice beautiful look. Alright, so it won't be long. I'll show you what it looks like so far. That's what they're looking like. Just trying to keep my wok hot. And this isn't going to take long, guys. This is Look, the pasta, as you guys know, the pasta I prepared before was from my previous dish, from the, uh, the South African dish. So I had some left and I thought I'd use that. Now, um, I haven't used the curly pasta in a long time, but I believe it's going to go really nice with this dish. So I thought I'd make it up anyway. I don't think this exists. But we'll see how we go. And my beautiful brothers and sisters from Italy. Oh my god, I love the olive oil. I love the the olives, the cheeses, uh, your culture, um, the flavors, everything, your personality. Mm, absolutely bellissimo. Alright. Alright, so the prawns are pretty much nearly ready, guys. I'll show you what they look like. I butterfly them. Michelle, that's what they look like, okay? They curl up a little bit. There we go. Not as good as maple cooks, but they are good. Alright, so that's nearly ready, guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add the pasta now, okay? I'm going to add the pasta. I'm going to put the pasta through the prawns. And this is going to be enough for like a few people. So what I've got is got my new tongs there with a bit of plastic on the end. Because you want to scratch the wok or the middle. I'm going to toss that through. Put that through the butter and everything. Until we're ready to add the uh, truffle oil and the parsley. That's actually sound good already. Toss it through as you go. Don't lose the pasta. Put it back in. Because you're going to need it. It's going to taste so good. Oh, you know what I forgot guys? The salt. Oh my god. How can I forget the sex of salt? The famous sex of salt you can say nuts in my cooking videos. Alright, so a little bit of salt guys for flavour. You don't want to like overdo it with salt because you want the sweetness of that beautiful truffle oil. The keep tossing. Right, so what I'm going to do now is because the pasta and those prawns are nearly ready. I just want to show you guys what a butterfly prawn looks like. So that's what happens, guys, when you butterfly and you cook them. Can you see, Michelle? Look at that. Beautiful. All right, so that's cooking. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add some parsley. with greenery in color. There we go, guys. Oh, by the way, guys, uh, everyone was mentioning the other day, you know, when I did the, I got the double, uh, double yoked uh, eggs, two in a row. And once said, oh, you should go get a, a, a lottery ticket walk there. You know, uh, uh, you know, guess what? I forgot that day. I got so busy, I forgot. But today, guys, while I was out and about, I actually got one for Oz Lotto and for Wednesday Night Lotto. Maybe it was meant to happen, okay? And um, I might win. You don't know. If I win, if I do win something good, I'm going to have a surprise uh, for our viewers out there. So, pray for me, guys. Hopefully, maybe, you don't know. All right, so... Now we're tossing our pasta in the garlic butter and everything. We're going to add the very expensive black truffle oil. Now guys, 
that's $120 a liter. $120. That's a lot of money. Okay? So I'm going to be a little bit generous. And I'm going to drizzle a bit in there. And we've got to... Whoa, I can smell that, eh? I'm going to toss that through. Oh my god. That has just changed the whole flavour, the smell, the aroma of this dish. That's looking good, but you know what? It needs a little bit more parsley. So now the rest of this parsley in there for a bit of colour. And by the way guys, I've only just gotten home. I've been up since uh, 5 o'clock this morning, running around and work, and it's, at the moment it's like 7 o'clock at night. So I've only had a chance to cook, and I wanted to share this with you guys. Alright. So, we're going to turn it off. And what we're going to do is have a bit of a taste test. And we'll um, put some on our plate for some photos. And we're going to go from the How long has it been, guys? 11 minutes. Alright, cool. I'll show you what it looks like. And then we'll have a bit of a taste test. That's what it looks like, guys. Alright. Turn it off. I'm just gonna plate one up. Sorry about the noise. I know it looks a little bit plain, but you know what? You can smell that truffle oil everywhere. And the garlic and the butter and everything. And you know what, I'm gonna I'll just do a bit more on this other one when I'm finished for the photo. But this is King's food day. Eh? Alright, that's the result guys. Oh my god. This is like better than a five-star restaurant. Hope everyone can see from the light. Just gonna tap in the middle. Bit more focus. Bit more focus there. How's that? Alright, but the important thing is guys, do you smell that aroma of uh, the truffle oil? So I'm just going to get a little bit on there. A little bit, yeah. Alright, I'm just going to get a fork. Look at that beautiful steam coming out. Oh my god, alright, so there's your prawn. I'm whispering, I don't know why I'm whispering. Maybe so the neighbors down here because they might come over and raid my kitchen because it smells so good. All right, there's our prawns, the butterfly. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is the best prawns I have had in a very long time. I'm not I'm not saying it, but you know what? Wow. All right. Our pasta, guys. Our dente. Oh my god, twice. Man, is that good. Alright, I'm going to do the, the pasta with the prawn. I'm telling you. Oh. I'm getting better and better at this. Alright, so, got our prawn and our pasta twirled on the fork. Mmm. Having the prawn. So I got some pasta in my tooth. Having some prawn with the pasta at the same time has released that beautiful aroma of that butter, the garlic, and the truffle oil. I have just created the most amazing the simplest dish. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. I said I might go three times, guys, so it must be good. You know what? Bellissimo. 
Thank you very much for watching, everyone. Make sure you subscribe, like, give me a thumbs up, hit the bell for further notifications. All right, I've had my pasta now with my truffle oil. I feel rich as hell. I'm gonna go buy a Ferrari, only if I could afford one. All right, guys, love you all. Take care, and don't forget to watch all my other videos. I love you all. Bye.